10 things you can do today to improve your life. Everyone desires to improve their life so that they leave the best one possible. But the hard part comes in figuring out how to improve your life and where to begin. While you may have massive ideas to change things up, the truth is that more sustainable actions and hacks actually help you improve your life on the daily, which really adds up over time. Improving your life doesn't have to be about making one big move of, or having to go through an epic transformation. Instead, it's something you can constantly work on regularly and it typically comes down to the small things you do every day. Contrary to popular belief, you don't have to make drastic changes in order to notice an improvement in the quality of your life. At the same time, you don't need to wait a long time in order to see the measurable results that come from taking positive action. The journey of self-improvement is an ongoing process of constant learning and improvement. It gives you the opportunity to evaluate your strengths and weaknesses and to work on them on a regular basis. The benefits are that you grow as a person while growing your skills, you improve your self-awareness and you boost your confidence. Furthermore, self-improvement also helps us sharpen our mental and physical health through better self-esteem, stress management and overall well-being. Dear future entrepreneurs and moguls, here are 10 things you can do today to improve your life. Number one, practice mindfulness. Mindfulness is a type of meditation in which you focus on being intensely aware of what you're sensing and feeling in the moment without interpretation or judgment. Practicing mindfulness can help us increase our ability to regulate emotions, decrease stress, anxiety, and depression. It can also help us to focus our attention as well as to observe our thoughts and feelings without judgment. Furthermore, mindfulness can help treat heart disease, lower blood pressure, reduce chronic pain, improve sleep, and alleviate, and alleviate uh, gastrointestinal difficulties. Practicing mindfulness involves breathing methods, guided imagery, and other practices to relax the body and mind and help reduce stress. Number two, exercise regularly. Regular physical activity can improve your muscle strength and boost your endurance. Exercise delivers oxygen and nutrients to your tissues and helps your cardiovascular system work more efficiently. And when your heart and lungs health improve, you have more energy to tackle daily tasks. It is recommended to aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate physical activity every day. If you would like to lose weight, maintain weight loss, or meet specific fitness goals, you may need to exercise more. Moreover, regular physical activity can help you fall asleep faster, get better sleep, and even deepen your sleep. Just, just don't try to exercise too close to bedtime or you may be too energized to go to sleep. Number three, 
hang around the right people. Surrounding yourself with the right people will help you to stay motivated and determined. Furthermore, it will make you want to do better and want to succeed harder. Hanging out with people who are determined will motivate you to want a better and more successful life. Moreover, in order to grow and improve your life, you need to be surrounded by like-minded people, as these people will understand the path that you are trying to go and will also understand your drive to better yourself and achieve your goals. Additionally, you will get better business advice and input from successful people and you will get better referrals from people who are more successful. Number four, create a morning routine. Morning routines help us set the tone for the day, better allowing us to control our schedules rather than our schedule controlling us. As we start each day fresh and energized, we can better focus on what is in front of us, where to prioritize our time, put all of our energy towards accomplishing the necessary tasks, and ultimately increase our productivity. Moreover, having a structured day can give you a sense of control. It can also improve your focus, organization, and productivity. Having a routine is about more than just completing your day-to-day -day responsibilities and your work. Don't forget to make spare time for self-care. Number five. Schedule your activities. Scheduling is the art of planning your activities to the best of your abilities so that you can achieve your goals and priorities in the allocated time. When it's done effectively, scheduling helps you understand what you, what you can realistically achieve with your time. Furthermore, having a schedule gives you structure. You know what tasks are priorities and are aware of the deadlines to complete them. No exception. As a result, you will do your best to knock these respons responsibilities out during the time you are allotted. During the times where you have nothing scheduled, you can allow life to flow and do whatever you want. Make sure you have enough time for essential tasks. Number six, be more optimistic. Optimism helps people achieve massive success. Optimism uh, goes beyond seeing the bright side of a situation or expecting good things. It's also a way of explaining what has already happened. Optimistic people succeed way more than pessimistic people because they don't view setbacks as personal failings. Optimists are able to bounce back from disappointment better than pessimists. Furthermore, they are able to achieve more and remain motivated no matter what happens. Moreover, optimism opens up uh, to new ideas, new experiences, and new possibilities. It frees us up, <laughs> it frees us up uh, to consider new options and change our businesses and lives for the better. It helps us uh, see the future and create expansive, uh, evolving realities. Number seven, detox from social media. A digital detox can be explained as a period of time when a person voluntarily refrains himself or herself from using digital devices such as smartphones, computers, and social media platforms and other services. Social media breaks can be good for our mental health and social life. It is no secret that the social media frenzy has uh, become out of control and studies are not showing that social media use can lead to low self-esteem, body image issues, anxiety, 
social isolation, and the list goes on. Furthermore, the more time you spend on a social media site, the more likely you are to develop depression. In other words, if you've been feeling highly anxious, stressed out, or depressed, this is a good time to take social media detox. Number 8. Stop judging other people. Judging others has good and bad sides. When you make choices based on observing and evaluating other people, you are using an important skill. When you judge people from a negative perspective, you are doing it to make yourself feel better and as a result, uh, the judgment is likely to be harmful to both of you. Sometimes, unknowingly, uh, we judge people as a reflection of what we feel or think about ourselves. However, what we don't realize is that once we stop being judgmental, we free ourselves from the negative emotions, preventing us from living a happy and fulfilled life. At times, it can get to the point where you are making so many judgments that it's hard to feel gratitude, which is when the judgments become extremely harmful for your own happiness and well-being. Research shows that being judgmental of others can negatively affect your self-esteem more than any outside force. Number 9. Take breaks accordingly. Working for long stretches without breaks leads to stress and exhaustion. Taking breaks refreshes the mind, replenishes your mental resources, and helps you become more creative. Furthermore, good breaks reduce mental fatigue, boost brain function, and help us stay focused. But taking too many breaks can backfire too. Because when you take the wrong kind of breaks, it actually gets harder to focus. Moreover, taking a short break allows your PFC a brief respite, which in turn allows you to come back to your tasks with a renewed vigor. So, if you want to get more done, you need to make sure you take effective breaks during your workday. Number 10. Get enough sleep. Sleep plays a vital role in good health and well-being throughout your life. Getting enough sleep uh, at the right times can help protect your mental health, physical health, quality of life, and safety. The way you feel while you're awake depends in part on what happens while you're sleeping. Sleep deprivation means poor performance and productivity. In conclusion, Improving your life doesn't have to be about making one big move or having to go through an epic transformation. Instead, it's something you can constantly work on regularly and it typically comes down to the small things you do every single day. The end. Thank you.